That stabbing happened at a middle school in Middletown, New York, which went on lockdown for several hours after. All right, Fox 5's Michelle Ross joins us live from the town of Wallkill Police Department in Middletown to walk us through exactly what happened. Michelle. Steve, Natasha, new information out of the police department here. They tell us two 13-year-olds were involved in this incident. One of the 13-year-olds was the victim suffering multiple stab wounds. He was taken to the hospital. The other 13-year-old was charged by police. Now, parents are questioning how a weapon was brought into the school. Parents lined up on County Route 78, rushing to Monhegan Middle School to pick up their children after receiving alerts about an incident involving students and what is believed to be a knife. What happened today is not okay. It is very concerning. It is upsetting. My heart hurts. The superintendent says a student stabbed a classmate. I saw a student walking like this. I see the one that got stabbed. I came back from breakfast over to the eighth grade wing where I saw a big crowd. Town of Wallkill police responded to the school and found a 13 year old student with multiple stab wounds, sparking a lockdown and forcing students to stay in the gym and library in darkness. The teachers, um, they were just saying to calm down because people were losing their minds. We were in like this little black room for a while. It was pretty scary, I'm totally honest, because like they kept talking. I was like, if you guys keep talking, we could seriously be harmed. Parents huddled outside the school for early dismissal and were relieved to reunite with their children. But after nationwide school shootings and recent school stabbings in New York City, they say more needs to be done. I'm still not understanding why the schools aren't putting in any metal detectors, you know, like they should be checking everybody's bags and personal belongings. Why wasn't there metal detectors already in place at the school? They do have metal detectors once in a while. I don't think that's sufficient enough. I think they should have it all the time. Again, the 13-year-old defendant has been charged by police. He's being prosecuted by the Orange County uh, Attorney's Office. Now, as far as what the school day will look like tomorrow, that is still in question. We're live in Middletown in Orange County. Michelle Ross, Fox 5 News. Natasha. All right, Michelle, thank you.